So yeah, so like I said, this is actually gonna be one of the weirder videos that I've ever done on this channel, or in general, honestly. But um, yeah, so this video is, like I said, is just gonna be about my gel pen collection. Yes, I have way more than these and um, different makers, I guess, and different color varieties as well. But for this one, they're just gonna be black and blue. Uh, for this one right here, they're, this one's from Uniball, Papermate, Uniball, uh, Pilot, and Hull. Yeah, so I'll get more depth into them, so don't worry. But um, I just wanted to tell you guys that all of these are uh, gel pens except this one right here. This one's just a ballpoint pen. I accidentally grabbed it while getting the pens for this video. And when I already had it, I said, well, why not? So I have that. And so now I'll just start introducing them. And then towards later in the video, I'll actually write with them. And you'll be able to see and judge my horrible writing. Um, yeah, yes, you can comment on it. Let me know how it is. I've already heard it all, so don't worry. My parents and... My sister always nag on me about it. So anyways, and so yeah, this first one is actually from Uniball. It's from the Signal line. And the model number for it, I'm assuming that's the model number, it's 207. Uh, this whole thing is plastic except the clip right here. It's uh, metal. And then the tip looks metal, but it's actually just plastic. And then the clicky thingy, it's sturdy. And I like it. I like it when it's sturdy like that. I don't like the fact that some pens, you just, you click it and it's like, I don't know, it's not as like, spring like the spring doesn't fight back with you as much i guess that's the best way i can explain it and out of all these pens the like the easiest one to click is the tall one like this pen is just smooth all around and i'll but i'll get into that later on let me just go to the next one but um and so the next one is papermate it's from the inkjoy line and yeah so and as you can see it's uh, 0.7 i forgot to mention these are all 0.7 all the pens that i have here in this video they're all 0.7 but um yeah so this whole thing is plastic and then it's covered by this like rubbery matte black finish thingy um it's not like an eraser rubbery i don't really know how to explain it but it's it's like rubbery it like, has a rubbery grip and the tip is the same thing and that's where you actually can take out the ink from you just unscrew the tip and yeah so there's that and then the, the only metal thing is the clicky thingy and it's very sturdy and I really like that like I said before and yeah um there's that and then the next one is from Uniball again um this one's the same thing the signal line and this one has a different number so this one is a 307 and the whole thing is plastic the only thing that is metal is actually none of it but out of all the pens that I have here on this table um this one's actually my favorite one I like the way it looks and all of that the tip itself is matte black and then the clip is like matte blue. If that's not blue, like if you guys want to get like all detailed as to what color that is, let me know, but that thing is blue. Anyway, so uh, the clicky thing is pretty sturdy. And I like that, like I said a bajillion times before. And so the next one is from Pilot and the line is Easy Touch. And the only interesting thing that I can say from uh, on this pen, because it's just a regular ballpoint pen, honestly. But the only interesting thing that I can say about it is that I've actually had these in my EBU pants. Um, back when I was in the military and when I would carry them around I would forget that they were in my pocket and so when I went to go wash my EBU pants uh, I'd leave them in there and the ink doesn't like bleed all over and I've washed it like six seven times and yeah the ink never bled out of it um I haven't had a gel pen in any of my EBU pants before but uh I know when I have them in my regular pants my civilian pants um yeah if I had a gel pen in there that's the end of my pants but um yeah, so that's pretty much all I can really say that's interesting about this, um, aside the fact that it's plastic. As you can see, it's been through the ringer, I guess. Um, <laughs> it's been through the washing machine, and it's through the rinse cycle, I guess. Uh, but the whole thing is plastic. The only metal thing really is that spring in there, and then the tip for the that. And so, yeah, that part is rubbery. Um, out of all the pens that have the rubbery grip, I kind of like this one the most, but it, I also like the Signal, the Uniball one. And But yeah, this one's actually a lot more comfortable, that's for sure. And so, there's that. But other than that, there's really nothing I can really say about this one, besides that it's just a regular ballpoint pen. And then last but not least is the Toll Pen. Out of all the pens that I currently have on this table, this writes the smoothest. And I honestly don't really like the fact that it writes so smooth. I know it's weird, but I don't like it. Um, I don't know why or how to explain that, but I just feel like I'm gliding through paper and I kind of feel like I'm writing really sloppy because of it. I kind of like the fact that, that some of the pens you can like actually feel the tension 
This one you can, it really just glides. And a lot of people like that, just not me. Uh, but the clicky thingy is very, like, very smooth. That's, and it's very easy to click. Yes, it stays there and everything. Like, it's not, like, very weak. But it's very smooth. And then uh, this whole thing is plastic except the clip. And except that little ring that's above the rubbery grip thingy. And then also the tip. The tip is, like, the most metal you have on this pen. And it's gold, colored. And no, it doesn't actually write gold, it, just, it writes black. And so here comes the part of the video where you guys can judge my writing. Uh, don't worry, I've heard it all. My parents, my sister, my family, like, believe me, they all judge my writing. And everybody at school used to do it too, so don't even worry, I'm already used to it. I used to write really bad, I know. Uh, now, I guess, like, I don't know, I still feel like I write bad, but, um, I don't know, you be the judge of that. Um, so. The first one I'm going to write with is the Papermates. It's the Inkjoy, the 0.7. And I'm so sorry if you guys can hear this like leaf blower in the background. It's my neighbor. Um, she does this all the time. It's really annoying. But anyways, uh, I tried to mute it out with like music as you can probably hear by now. Anyways, the first one is Papermates, the Inkjoy like I said. And I'll just write, hi, YouTube, uh, boop, boop, boop. Yeah, so there's that. That's... Oh, let me write paper meat on the side. Paper... Meat. Oh, I actually did a capital M. Oh, actually, that's what it is. Okay, so... Alright, so that's paper meat. This next one is the Uniball, the 207. Uh, the signal line. And so, here's this. Hi... YouTube... I know, I talk when I write when I'm alone, sorry. Uh, Uniball. I feel like, I feel like the parent when they're spoon feeding their, their kid or something, they're trying to like do the airplane thing. I kind of feel like that right now. But anyways, this next one is a tall one. And like I said, this one is actually the smoothest one to write with. And I don't really like it because of that, but a lot of people do. So, hi, YouTube. Like, I honestly don't even feel the fact that I'm, like, pushing it on the paper. Um, yeah, so there's that. Toll. And then... And then the next one is the Uniball. The signal line is the 307. Is the model thingy right there. And then, so, here goes. Hi. You. Two. Doop. And then I'll write... Unib ball. And then the last one is gonna be pilots, the easy touch. It's just a regular ballpoint pen. So hi YouTube. Boop. And then I'll write pilot. Um yeah, there's there's that. <laughs> Those are all the pens that I that uh, that I have and that's how I write. I know it's horrible. Um, I know you guys are probably wondering, like, why the heck are you so interested in gel pens? Uh, I don't really know. In middle school, I used to, like, not be into them. And I think that's when I first started. Uh, because when I had a regular ballpoint pen, I used to, like, write my name a lot. But not as in, like, regular standard, like that. I wouldn't write my name like that. I would write it as in, like, tagging kind of thing. Like, the tagging style. So I'd write it like that. Like, it looks so lame. I'm trying to copy how I did it before. Uh, like, I really didn't know. So yeah, that's how I used to do it. And that honestly looks, like, really lame now. The way I do it now is with the gel pen. And the way I write it now is a lot different. Um, it's like... Honestly, it's not that, not that big of a difference, but that's how I write it now. Um... I haven't really practiced in a long time, so it's not like I'm a professional or anything. But, um, yeah, there's that. And so I'll write it with the toll pen as well. It's a lot more bolder than the other ones, that's for sure. But the only time I prefer this is when I'm writing things like that. Other than that, like when I'm writing like actual documents or whatever, I don't like to do that just because it's like... I feel like I mess up and I write a lot sloppier. So, 
And so these are just extra parts of the video. You guys don't really need to see this, but if you guys are, hey, thanks for for watching it this far. Write pudding in the comments and let me know so that way I can know that you guys are watching it this far. And see if you guys actually watched the whole video or just parts that you're interested in. I don't know. But um yeah guys, so so I'll just write so apart from that I'll so I guess I'll write something else and then I'll end the video. But um, this one's from the Uniball, the Signal 207. And uh, the rubbery grip thingy is like textured. I'm pretty sure I showed you guys. And so now I'll just write with this one and then I'll just end the video. But this one's the Uniball Signal, the 207, the one with the rubbery textured grip. It's pretty cool. Um, but I don't know what else to write though. Um, I'll write Shadow. Ah, dang, I kind of messed up. Okay, that kind of looks kind of lame, but... I haven't done the S's in a long time. I write like horrible twos and whatever, I don't know. So, there's that. I really don't know what else to write. <laughs> um, but yeah guys, uh, I really don't know what else to do in this video, but um, yeah. So sorry about the Air Force videos that I haven't really been uploading them. Um, I do have them, I just, honestly I've just been really lazy. And a lot of things have happened and I kind of just kind of lost my groove to do that, to do the videos, but they are there. Don't worry, I am editing them and they will be uploaded. Um, yeah, but if you guys have any video suggestions, just lower, put them in the comment section. But yeah guys, other than that, that's really the end of the video. I do like apologize for the fact that I haven't really done any Air Force videos or I haven't uploaded them. I do have them, it's just I've honestly just been really lazy to do them because a lot of things have happened and I'll explain this in like later videos, but a lot of things have happened and I kind of just lost my groove to do videos. But um, yeah guys, so they will be uploaded soon. I do have them. I don't really know exactly when they'll be uploaded, but but yeah guys, other than that, I will see you later. Okay, so other than that, I'll see you guys later. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and honestly, if you guys watched it, awesome. So, alright guys, see ya!